Aloha from Oahu. We're at a local farm here and uh, we're gonna pick up some uh, produce. So uh, we're having a lot of fun here out and about with our friend Deb again. And it is June 22nd, 930 in the morning. And I think it's about 82 degrees already. And I forgot my Kinetagan devotional book, but I was listening to Kenyon this morning on confessions for divine health. And I got a revelation while I was listening. You know, Jesus, he carried our sickness and our pains for us so that we don't have to. And um, I just got a real revelation about that and how when he died on the cross, our sins were obliterated. Of course, we received that by faith. Well, the sickness and the disease was also obliterated because he carried all that on the cross and paid for it completely. So we received that by faith also. So I was thinking about any symptoms that I might experience that they are already uh, Jesus already carried those for me so I don't have to and um, they're like rubbish they're like something uh, that doesn't belong to me what that was a word that God gave me about sickness and disease he, and symptoms he said it's not yours and so I just consider it as rubbish in my body to throw away and to cast out and get rid of so it's not mine so I throw out all uh, symptoms of sickness and disease out of my body right now in the name of Jesus. And I declare for my body that I'm walking in divine health and that I have unimpaired health. That's one of the definitions in the Bible, in the original language, unimpaired health and soundness, soundness of body. So there's peace, peace in my flesh, because Jesus carried all my sickness and all my pains for me, so I don't have to. And I thank you for that, Jesus, and I receive it by faith. I love you. Thank you, Jesus. Aloha, everybody. I pray that you also get the revelation of that promise to us from Jesus Christ, that it will become yours and you'll reject and resist sickness and disease as it says to do in James 4, 7. Submit to God, resist the devil, and he will flee from you. Sickness and disease is not from God, it is from the devil. And we're to resist it and, and command it to go. And it will, because we have all power and authority over all the power of the enemy. It's all in scripture. These are the things we need to meditate on and believe and walk in and take it by faith so that we can experience divine health while we're walking on this earth. Okay, have a beautiful Thursday. God bless you and aloha. Mwah.